Hello everybody, welcome to the second match of Blood Bowl Super League um, Here in Group B, this is uh, not the group that I am part of um, But it is a very good group We've got Crucifer and Hiru, who are playing right now We've got Andy Davo, Artemis Black, Sol and Olivier Dulac So uh, unbelievably, unbelievably strong group and uh, there are no inducements so I expected this part to go quicker than it has done <laughs> um, here we go and yeah Hiru doesn't get to pick anything here here because his his team is worth less you know to try and balance it right uh, there's also no press to nuffle uh, obviously by normally by default for every 50k you don't spend you get press to nuffle but uh cyanide very very you know cyanide and nacon listen to the feedback from the playoffs and there is now an option to turn off the default press to nuffle which is rather good isn't it rather good so here we go we've got hero dwarves Crucifer with humans and Cruz chose to kick. I guess so he's defending with eleven players and you know you know best chance to turn over the dwarves, but I mean good luck turning them over. Five guard. Four. Really incredible team. And oh oh okay, so Hiru has painted his team a black and white checkers. And Cruz has gone with blue. Let's switch them to blue and red, because I think that's better. And who's this? Somebody in the booth? Oh my god, it's the champ himself! Why are you, man? <laughs> how are you, man? How are you? How's it going, mate? Uh, how are you doing? Uh, not bad, thanks. How are you? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I'm really excited for this one. Good blood bowl. Yeah. I don't think I've seen Hero play Cruise before, either. No, I'm not sure I have either. Um... Maybe. I probably, surely in the cup, they must have. They, or maybe he's in Blitz Pit, they must have done, right? We must have. We don't have uh, EAB anymore to do the verses. Mm. It's tragic, uh, isn't it? A tragic I can't loss believe Cruz didn't name his team either Tiredness, How to Make a Smoothie, or Owl Watch. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> like, what is it? Like, that's how disillusioned he is with BB3. <laughs> he can't even name a team Owl Watch. <laughs> there was another one as well, wasn't there? There was there was like another one even after the, yeah, there was an extra one. I know like tiredness was his desperate there wasn't one like even more desperate than tiredness. I can't remember what it was, like depression or something. It wasn't that, but there was there was another one, like a one off. Oh yeah, furniture oh, yeah. of course. Furniture. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, so the timeout happens. Uh, rule of five standard rule of five for Cruz. Tackle is, of course, a dead skill here. Pretty good for the humans, I'd say. Mm, maybe. That isn't pretty good for the humans, though. Instant Kaz. All instant should have played knobs. Full I mean, instant should have played that, orbs. That would have oh, no, it's a nine, wouldn't it? Mm, it wouldn't it mighty blow, though, a mighty blow, so... So, it would have Kaz an orc, yeah? Yeah, it would have Kaz it. Would have Kaz anything? In his armor. Did he appo it? No, he didn't. Has he got an appo yet? Or he rolls yeah. appo? Yeah, it's just a lineman in it. He'll probably, he'll probably it? take more punishment. Dispose of his AV8s or 9 tosses. I mean, he can't not, can he? Oh, oh, Hiru. Yeah, he can't not. That, this is the problem with having multiple slayers, isn't it? It's I basically going to damage them in some guard. Yes. Mm. Then we're going to see an ogre blitz into boneheads. Mmm, the classic. <laughs> the absolute classic Ogre Blitz and Bonehead. Do you know what? I don't think my troll boneheaded the entire game in my first round match. Bruce has half the guard he did with nobility. <laughs> That's true. Do you know oh, what? I, I, half, half strength human team. Yeah, alright. I think I might make this sound effect now. <laughs> <laughs> it could be a rather good sound effect, you know. What? Um, just a good one, didn't he? Oh, he's just left that. He's just left his slayer there, like with no guard protection or anything. 
He can mm. like three dice it with an ogre. Yeah, he mm. could. I'm for the problem you give up the block though, don't you? Three dice him. Yeah, and it's the block. With Glorious. The well. No, I dice? won't give in until I'm victorious. I think I'm hitting. And the I will off. defend. One hundred. I will defend. I mean, you're definitely. I mean, you're definitely hitting the the the, the, the troll, troll slayer. slayer. I mean, so. Yeah, you're yeah, definitely so. hitting him. But it's just whether you make it three or not. Yeah. Oh yeah, and he's got the tackle, which is absolutely useless. Yeah, either. dead skill. Yeah. Yeah. Dead skill. Doesn't have stand firm. Doesn't have wrestle. <laughs> I mean, what like what are his chances? Honestly, lads, I think this is like it's right up against it here. Oh, thanks for coming for Look at that, the salesman. Yeah, this is just going for the 2D. And you were correct to me in a bonehead. Amazing. <laughs> it's almost like I played Blood Bowl before, Jim. Yeah, almost. And, uh, dodge fail into a removal? No, no, I don't play enough. And uh, good evening, Randy Tanner. Thank you very much. Staying fantastic for over two years. Unbelievable. Absolutely glorious. Thank you very much. This, this, this uh, is now going to blitz the ogre with the mighty blow troll slayer oh he's not going to do it is he I was no. going to say like <clears throat> and then he was going to like fail the, he'll, he'll push it and then fail the dauntless into a 1d cas but like yeah we can get roll a 10 on the armor old hero in a, in a hurry to get forward I guess I don't hate this dwarves are slow right yeah, they are slow, taking a leaf out of PC's book, you know, yeah. pressing forward as much as soon as possible. Oh, I T don't like that, he's just giving him a, f well... Yeah, he's tagging the ogre though, isn't he? doesn't want him to... Yeah, but he's giving him a free dice, right? And this is going to put the guard in behind him. But then if you put the guard in behind him, then <clears throat> you got the follow-up, right? Well, I don't know, actually. Yeah. Um, yeah, for Ollie, if if you join the Discord there and then post that in the Discord and then uh, I'll message you later because it you know it takes a little bit of time. <laughs> and he's got the Slayer as like the front right corner. Yeah, exposing the Slayers. That's his he trademark. Could've, yeah, you could have had it. You could have just had the blocker there, right? Uh, yeah, I well, mean, I guess. Cruz could still hit the Slayer if it was the top left corner. But. He could have just had one Slayer. I kind of hate having the second, honestly. I really do kind of hate it. But I guess the speed's like good against, like, you know, Skate. Oh my god, yeah. This is the fastest dwarf team imaginable, generally. <laughs> it really is, yeah. It's max speed dwarves. It's like <laughs> the Olympic dwarfs. The runner is on the bench, so it's not actually max speed, but uh, <laughs> it's <laughs> the, the, the roster is max speed. Max speed roster. <laughs> Four. I mean, all those movement seven players is an absolute dream. <laughs> yep. So he's he's stopping the three dice right by putting these two guys there. But no, because he could just put the guard in and then take the three dice and then blitz that guard. I mean, like it's early for the dwarves to get forward. Like it, it's. I I think I just want to hit the troll slayer. Right, that's the thing. Yeah, blitz the blitz the slayer and then just take this block. Yeah. I just want to be hitting slayers every time that I yeah. can. Yeah. And, um, <clears throat> million percent. I don't know if are we foul. He's got the halfling, but I guess like he's got the halfling for the throw teammate, Tuddy. And just because it fits the money as well, right? Like you're better Hang off on. having a player. Oh, he's got that. one catcher bench. So he's he's fielded one catcher and bench run. Right? Okay. Oh, this is a throw, maybe? Uh, yeah, catcher, yeah, two catchers, both with block. Yeah. No thrower? Whoa. Uh, maybe it's a skillless thrower. Where's the thrower? Oh, I tell you what I can do. I can put the skill rings on, can't I? Where's the skill rings? I don't, I don't see it. Unless that was the guy that got cat. No, he couldn't be. Is that Zed? Yeah, Zed. Zed is skill. Uh, Zed is... So there, that's the thrower there. Look, he's there. Just skillless. Skillless thrower. Or the one on the floor that stuns. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I was gonna say like, there's no way you can build humans without a thrower. Oh, so the, the skill that he's lost, he's he's turned guard into block on the on the on the ogre. Yeah, yeah. Him. I like I like a block ogre, but unfortunately he's boneheaded and pushed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You do nothing. <laughs> yeah, that's why I don't really like the block ogre. Right. It's already like oh no, so I much like TV. It. I like it's so much TV in like one. 
you know, one. But TV doesn't does. matter in race. TV doesn't matter in race. Well, it does. It's the resources that you're spending to win the game, right? So, like. Yeah, but I mean, like you have the eleven fifty team build, right? So it's like. But it's still the points I, I, that you're yeah, spending. Yeah, I get what you're saying. I get yeah. what you're saying. But like, mm. where else is the double going? Like, they have. Well, it could have an extra skill, so it could have been a guard on the on the, and it could have been like an extra guard, right? What instead of the tackle? Yeah, so he could have had yeah. five guard, and instead he's. Got oh, what you three. mean like a what like a guard liner or something? No, he could have had a guard instead of the tackle and guard on oh. the a guard on the oh, uh, ogre, and then a block thrower, for example. I don't know. I I'm a big fan of the block. Ogre. <clears throat> I'm hoping he, he. Oh yeah, the problem is that if he rolls the both down, like he's not going to get Kaz anyway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of <laughs> Like it's I quite good because it means you can't get uphill, right? It's it's really easy to yeah. like. It's really nice to uphill big guys nowadays, um, because they don't get the mighty Trump's blow on it. But maybe yeah, maybe yeah, maybe he finds himself based on a runner at some point. <laughs> <You> never <laughs> yeah, know. Maybe maybe. Damn for. Yeah, the the riot is really going to make it a lot harder for... Yeah, I was going to say, like, it's already, like, squeaky bum time. He's got to be dodging this Slayer, right? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Because like he might get pushed and pushed and pushed, right? So. Pushed? Yeah, I mean... If he gets pushed a few right. times, he, he might be better off just pushing him away here. Yeah, he does. Because he wants to get over and shut down this yeah. side as well. But I mean, all the fast, responsive players are on the left side, Jim. <laughs> I feel like he probably could have taken the extra hit. I think probably uh, push him to yeah. there and take one extra hit on him. Because you want some players over here anyway, and obviously knocking him over is, is a lot better. Because he can still switch back to this side, right? Didn't take the three dice. Because now, the fact that he didn't push him there for a follow-up hit means like what are these guys going to do are they going to go further out or are they going to switch over if they're switching well, I mean, if they're going mm, further out I, they could have just punched that guy I'd imagine yeah yeah but I'd imagine Hero is going to come down the side with the five guard on it rather than <laughs> the, the two yes. idiots with mohawks but shouldn't you like you should have moved one already right you should have at least move one over already to get yeah. something over there he's, he's good he's good he's cool we're talking about the goat here Jimmy I know yeah Glorious, yeah, Randy. Hey, look, I do it too. I did, I did it in my game. Um, you know, it's easy. It's easy to not do it. But you know, those two guys should have moved first, right? It's just like it's just a good thing that you can point out to 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 like oh, yeah, know, beginners yeah, and stuff. These two should have absolutely. just already moved a hundred percent. Hundred percent. Those two guys should have already moved before making that blitz and stuff. Okay, so he has moved this guy around. Okay, so that makes pushing the Slayer away a bit better. Quite like this as well, actually making that making the screen with the ogre is pretty nice, isn't it? And that kind of strands yeah. these two, which is pretty cool. I think I like I think I like that guard being one up because then it stops them getting an assist from the bottom. Mm. Right, so and like honestly, I guess what's he saying here? Is he saying he wants him to blitz through the guard? Yeah, if he wants to do anything, he's going to have to blitz through the guard, yeah. If he wants to go that way, he has to blitz through the guard. Or well, these I mean, two have to like, come guard, around. Yeah, if, if the guard is one square up, I don't know. I think I prefer the guard one square up. But I, don't know if you... I think I prefer him there, honestly. Because if you want to look, you can blitz him into Mighty Blow and smash him again. Oh, that's why he's done it. So, yeah, he's, he's, so he doesn't get the follow-up hit. I get it. Right, okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. I was just thinking, because you don't, like, it, it stops that whole bottom row being an assist for the ogre, yeah. Yeah. But then you kind of want him to hit the ogre as well, don't you? Really, because if he's if he's I spending, guess, yeah, yeah, he's, the yeah, he's the idiot. You want to get punched in the head, right? Mm. The twat we've magnet. Got, we've, all, we've all got that, mate. We go to the pub. With. <laughs> <laughs> oh, glorious. I don't know if I replied, but yes, that's glorious news, Randy Tanner. You're welcome, and uh, yes, uh, humans getting dicked on. I mean, maybe Rubinho, but you know, Chris is very good at the blood balls, isn't he? And, and humans mean, yeah, are very got, capable. All he needs of doing is a things. one turn, and like honestly, like the dwarves aren't like in a threatening position, really. Like he could get a hit on the ball here. I mean, he, yeah, this is. I don't want to say terrible, but like this is. Oh no, he couldn't. I thought it wasn't screened. 
I thought it wasn't screened and I just thought you could knock these two and then run around. But I just somehow just didn't see this guy. <laughs> you can believe that. Uh, you just hit him. <laughs> it does look like it does look it's like an optical illusion, it makes it look like bigger than it is. No way. I need one of those. <laughs> I think they call it a magnifying glass. <laughs> <laughs> this three guard is brutal, but he can blitz this guy and chain off his guy. That's probably the best, right? Blitz this one. Or chain the one guard out. Mm. Yeah, but then he's got to get rid of that other guard first. Mm. And he's got, like... Not I many guess, people to do it. Yeah, because it, when he puts the assist in, he hasn't got another player to assist the blitz to chain the guard out. He puts him in. He blocks. He moves to assist, yeah, yeah, yeah. he blitzes, chains, runs there. Who moves to assist? This guy. Oh, I can't see. Your, your waving is terrible. Oh, this guy. The thrower, the thrower assists. He's here. the guy who's blitzing the guard, isn't no, he? No, no, the blitzer blitzes. It's this blitzer blitzes. So. Oh, no, okay, so this guy. So the yeah, thrower, yeah, yeah, the exactly. thrower, it's, no, no, it's easy, Dimmy, it's easy. The thrower assists here, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The lineman yeah, blocks it. here. Pushes him to there, so now oh, you have you this with blitzer. Yeah, you and then you've the got lineman. both blitzers. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, I'll forgive you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hello, Tim. Uh, yeah. Oh, he's but doing it this way, like, so he wants to do it yeah, this way. I was thinking the way you do it with a human lineman, it's a one in nine, and like I was thinking you, you block with the guard. He's just dodging, he's just doing a big boy dodge. Yeah, big boy. Big boy dodge. You, you've got to block with the line up because you have to free you have there's, to free there's, blitzer. There's not a surf here, is there? I guess you can pin mm. him on the sideline. Um, if he gets the power. No, here. I think he'll just chain him away, right, so he can block the other guy. Oh, uh, I thought he was gonna blitz with the guy. Why? Oh, has the throw got blocked? The throw's not. Like no, no, that well, was I, not what I would have done. <laughs> yeah, like he's he's obviously wanted that guard there, but I guess he wants to protect the thrower for the one turn, right? Yeah, I guess so. so yeah. yeah, but yeah, hard on it. That was nice. I like that chain there, and it got them, got them to hit would you, them. Would you say really nice, Tim? Really nice. Yeah, yeah. My instinct oh, was to just blitz this guy in screen, but this is much better, isn't it? Knocking him over. Mate, I hate it when you break armor on a dwarf, and it's just a stun. <laughs> oh my god, they're like they're so rare. Armor breaks on dwarves. Yeah. And then you're like. Yeah. It's like Zons, isn't it? It's like Zons when you when you knock them over oh and don't break God, their armor or anything. It's so and much rage. Yeah. <laughs> when you finally roll the power and they, they don't instantly explode. You're like, yeah. what? <laughs> They're ever <over> seven! <laughs> or like, or like oh. snotlings, isn't it? When you don't break mm. armor on a snotling. Oh my God, that, yeah. that's rage inducing. <laughs> and, and then like the next turn, a snotling will like kaz one of your positionals with the block. <laughs> And you're yeah. like, oh my god, this is just every time. So many, so many psychological warfare going on, like <laughs> <laughs> in the background of both these players. Mm -hmm. Yeah, stun is good. Yeah, of course, stun's good. It's just you know, a removal would have been better, wouldn't it? Well, see, it's only like Cruz is still on ten players, and they're like, to be fair, although it is a stun, it's a stun on a guard piece, which makes hero's job. Significant. It is turn six. Yeah, it's turn six, and it's his furthest forward and guard piece as well. Bogged down. He's mm. going to be throwing a pass to throw a pass to the troll slayer hero. Go on, mate. You know you want to. And look at this. The the, the cage is the base is the cage is based. Yeah. Can't speak English. The it, cage they, is based. The base is caged. The base is caged. The turkey baster is in. Like this is problematic, isn't it? To say the least. He's, he's going nowhere, Jim. He's going nowhere. He could probably chain. Oh no, maybe. Maybe. I wonder if he could chain his own guy onto the ball here. Yeah, he's got three guards. That's not. That's a stupid idea. <laughs> Even if he could. Just to push on there. Oh, he had to re-roll it as well. Mmm. Mm. He needs an armor break here, doesn't he? Glorious for all here. Cheers. Um, I don't know if he needs an armor break. No, the chain off's pretty nice, isn't it? Gets it anyway though. Lucky bastard. Gets a gas. <laughs> It's Apple Raffa, instant there, badly yeah, hurt. Yeah, badly hurt. Apple, yeah. yeah. No doubt. Instant guard blitz are badly hurt. Oh, do you wonder if Cruz's team name is based on him counting his players on turn 16? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, yeah. 
I mean, that's what he, that's, he was like, hmm. <laughs> what would they look like on turn 16? <laughs> I mean, you can uphill the ball, like, easily. Easily. Instant, like, an instant uphill, right? Guard goes yeah, in, yeah, stand up, 2D for a push, and then you just straight in uphill with block versus like, no block. And it's, uh, what you call it? Yeah, no block. No block. Okay, he's yep, so <laughs> he realises that. Now he can come run around and get him, maybe. One, two, three, yeah, four, five, six, the, seven, the, nine, the one ten. thing we've really got to watch out for is the potatoes to the left. Yeah, the, <laughs> the switch, oh, the switch. Uh, the, yeah, the switch, but it's hard, isn't it? Look how deep he is on turn six. Yeah. He's so deep. He's going to have to go pretty much full movement this turn. Yeah. Or, I mean, he's kind of got a base of player to keep him away from getting behind the rest of them. Mm, this is still tricky for Cruz, but um, wow. There's no surf on this. So... Well, that's a big pal. If this is a KO, uh, a KO. <laughs> if this is a death, this <laughs> is great. <laughs> this is done. I guess the guard does come in now, right, to give him an extra block. Yeah, 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 you're punching that blocker all day. Yeah, you have to. I don't even know if you activate any ogre here, honestly. I think, like, that's the f annoying thing about it. It's like, it doesn't just, come in. It doesn't come in? Just screening. Oh, well, I guess he's used his Apo now, so now he's reluctant to base. And it's like, oh, the follow. I don't like yeah, the yeah, follow. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. I like the follow. Have to. I like the follow. Maybe yeah. you him across one. Cause it, and it's tackle. He's an idiot. He's... <laughs> freaking useless like you're protecting the guards like and that side you don't want to leave like the the because all you have to do is put the guard in and then blitz there, yeah. and he's got the channel he does he's block gonna have, the he's, 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 he's gonna have to dodge with this idiot he oh, oh 1d you can just 1d 3 plus right same as a dodge uh yeah yeah I think. or he can dodge to there yeah they're both they're both good but he's got to do one of them yeah yeah maybe the dodge only, is better the only issue is now is the troll slayer is actually going to be really useful because <laughs> he's going to put the ogre with it isn't he? <laughs> I guess the pow armor oh, break <laughs> blitzing oh, the break. ogre blitzing <laughs> blitzing the ogre is too too wide right he needs he needs he needs penetration but he just he just can't do it oh that is true he does need penetration mm. maybe double penetration. No, oh, he's 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 made a gate dodge, hasn't he, with this? But even oh, that, it's still well, too far away. Oh, dead, dead, dead. Oh, it's just a lino, isn't it? Yeah. It's yep. just a lino. But still, what that's two cars like and Apple gone. Well, he had so he's fielding a halfling. Right, he's fielding a halfling. It's... You can get to there with a ball carrier. But I mean, there's still yeah, two free players. Yeah, but you can't protect it or anything, mate. Yeah. It's just all potato. And Cruz can still get a scoring threat this drive. Yeah, so, more like, or less, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus, he's got three guarders all pinned on the sideline, which he dared not stand up. Like, he just can't stand that one up on the side because the stun behind him is going to get him surfed. Yep. I mean, that, yeah, that's all over anyway, right? Like, he couldn't. Even if yeah. he could stand them up, this, this flank is lost. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's just this full potato. Yeah, that's all there is. <laughs> honestly, honestly, we like. Do you even try? Because if he tries to score, he might get counter scored on. Whereas if he doesn't try and score, he's going to be up players in the second. Well, he's, it's very he's unlikely. Up players, right, but counter score. You say that, Jim? It's crucified. <laughs> oh well, is he just going to give up? He's moved this player here. That that implies this guy to here and just screen. Nope, he's gone for it. Yes, I think he had to. And the counter score isn't too unlikely. If there was a catcher here, then I'd think more about not going for it. But I think you have to go for it here. This isn't easy to stop, is it? It's, what is it? Double GFI to hit him. Okay, it's pretty easy to stop. But it's not easy to count score. <laughs> it's, it's two two pluses. It's basically impossible, Jimmy. <laughs> uh, uh, no, no, because he, he, he could have stood this guy up, actually. I think it probably was worth getting that guy surfed. 
because he could have only one deed him. So it probably was worth getting this guy surfed, honestly. With the apo, I don't know. I don't know, Jim. He doesn't. He's still got the apo, yeah, and he's got a reserve. So All right, Jim. I think stand this guy up, and then he's going to make a one deed to surf him, right? To clear to clear from him, or just dodge with somebody. I guess it would have just made him dodge with this guy instead, right? Yeah, he's good. That's the pal. Full instant power, and that's why he is the goat. Because <laughs> he rolls pals. <laughs> Fucking rolls pals, what a legend. <laughs> and this is only a catcher, right? So it's really hard to 2D him. Can he get into range with that tackle piece? If he 1Ds the troll slayer and then dodges backwards. Or is he going well, to one this guy and then gets in range with the guarder, right? When people play. Oh, yeah, because then it's a 3 plus. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I see it, Jim. I see it. Yep. Can but you I see the play, guys? That is not the play because, uh, yeah, try and pick up the ball to make it harder for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, hey, make it harder for him. <laughs> hey! <laughs> yeah, and dodge with the catcher. Yeah. And dodge with him. Oh, well. he, Full he's, cage. he's pretty good at blood bowling, the old cruise. Not he's bad. Gonna run out. He's going to run out of players anyway and lose. This is my experience of Blood Bowl. Well. Winning every game. <laughs> absolutely destroying my opponent. Completely outplaying him. And then just everyone dies. So I lose anyway. Mm. And I'm like, that is a joke. Just for clarity. Heroes <laughs> not being completely outplayed. No. But I mean, this is the problem with Dwarves, isn't it? I mean, he, he had the classic Dwarf problem, isn't it? Versus like good defence. Like, yeah, and he even made he, the he removals. He came up a little bit short, didn't he, Jim? Hey! And I mean, he made three removals. Like, normally, like, obviously, Cruz is great. Normally, people don't play that well against you. And if you get three reroll, if you get three removals, you do get to break through. But, like, it's tough, you know. Like, dwarves are tough. It's actually tough to get penetration for dwarves. They're just they're too short, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Always coming up short, the old dwarves. Mm. Like, is he going to foul this ogre? Has he got his eyes? He's rolled a one on the Dauntless? That doesn't matter anyway, does it? No, he probably should foul him because he's got the reserve, it's hasn't he? And there's no right. overtime. Oh, it was the rush. It was the rush. Yeah. There's no overtime, so... Yeah, oh, he broke armor. Him. Basically, yeah, no Apo as well. And it's a what? It's going to be... Six assists, so... <laughs> three Seven plus? assists? <laughs> Seven assists. This is a 3 plus, isn't it? A 3 plus foul. So it's almost guaranteed unless it's a snake. And just a stun. He rolls a 9. And then he. Uh, they were the wrong way round, Jim. <laughs> yeah, they were yeah, the wrong they way were. round. Yep, yeah, I would have got a kill. Trust, trust him to get his dice the wrong way round. <laughs> boner roll, yeah, the boner roll! <laughs> 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 Remember that, Dimmy? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> the boner roll. <laughs> oh dear. So, a successful defense from Cruz, but pretty costly, right? Two, two Lyman cast, so he's going to have to field the halfling on offense, but he got the stop, it's nil nil. If he can get his drive done, and you know, also he could just score and then still defend as well, right? He could score in four or five and still defend Bang in one nil. So. Yeah. Yeah, I think I he guess, just scores any time he can, really, now. Uh, yeah, like, you just play it by ear, right? You play it by ear. Like, Cruz is really freaking good. Like, he'll he'll know what to do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just watching this, like, making notes on how to play football. <laughs> and then I'll forget them all and then lose my next five games. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be like, oh, he's good, isn't he? <laughs> oh, he's, oh, he's good. good. Oh, he's good. He is, isn't he? Mate, all the Russians are pretty good at Blood Bowl. Well, not all Spanish of them, but there's, good a, at, there's a few. No, no, there's, there's a lot. There's a lot of good Spanish. Like, the the Russians tend to be good at the online Blood Bowl, whereas the Spanish are kind of good at, like, tabletop and online. Mm. Uh, Blitzer, Randy. Blitzer. No, I don't know. I don't know what the Russian tabletop scene's like, to be honest with you. It might be very good. I don't know. Um, no, I and don't think. Like, I don't think it's. It's probably not like NAF, is it? You know, like there doesn't seem many on the NAF rankings, does there? Maybe they just. I, mean, I imagine there is some sort of like maybe I don't know. It's hard to know, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, 
Russian tabletop blood bowl. I mean, <clears throat> I'd probably lose every game if I was playing against Diomed, Cruz, World Sitar, Pupok. Like, who else is Russian? And I mean, the biggest to... barrier to entry about uh, to be no, good no. in NAF is to be fucking loaded, right? That's the oh, biggest well, barrier to doing well in NAF. Yeah. I love Blood Bowl yeah. 3! That's the I biggest mean, like, I love Honestly, Eat Glass. Blood Bowl's getting bigger and there's more and more tournaments. Like, <laughs> like my first couple of tournaments a couple of years ago, I was paying like hundreds of pounds to travel the whole length of England. Like, now they're <laughs> on my doorstep. Mm. I'm paying like 15 quid for a ticket and 20 quid for a train. Yes, yeah, so that's the thing, right? So Russia, don't know if you know, is a pretty it's big country. Pretty big, yeah, it's pretty big. <laughs> so, yeah. so even even to go to Russian tournaments, it's it's going to be a ball ache for them. And the then Americans, if they want to go to like yeah. European ones, it's going to yeah, America don't haven't so got like, much of a take like a nine somewhere. hour flight to play blood bowl. Yeah, <laughs> their local tournament. Yeah. So there you go. So yeah, Russia's got the same the same issues as America, like times ten, right? Yeah. It's, a, it's a bigger country, Apparently, not as rich a country. Canada as well. Mm. <clears throat> but they all have nicer houses and a better lifestyle, you know. So, like, I mean, it's a pretty good trade. <laughs> yeah, and that's the thing, you know. It's funny, like, no disrespect, of course, to Olivia <laughs> Delac, but uh, as I was saying, like, you know, like that—that's a huge barrier to entry is just how many tournaments he goes to. Do you know what I mean? Like, if he, yeah, if you ain't got the money to go to that many tournaments, you ain't going to be ranked as high as him. That's just a yeah. Fact. But the French are very good at tabletop, mm. and like so he's obviously playing against some pretty good players when he's winning these tournaments. I mean, obviously there's going to be some like crappy ones in there. <laughs> yeah. The, the, like the way to get your ranking high is to beat high-ranked players, right? That's the yes. thing. Yes. There's, so, a, like, there's a lot of good. There's a lot of good. Ra there's a lot of high-ranked players in England uh, also, Timmy. But you know what happens sometimes? You win your first two games, then play goblins in your third game after winning two. Yeah, and get twenty five cas. <laughs> yeah, some people, some people get to do that, you know. <laughs> so pretty, you can't say anything positive about the French. So here we go. So the dwarves just piling in. A bit of guard there. They can't really guard lock, can they? Like this is a bit rowdy. Standing these guys up, I'm not sure I'd have stood up in the middle there. Um, but like I quite like putting the guards on him because he can't do anything, can he? No block. I think he just wants to bang, man. He just just let yeah. me bang. Yeah, just let yeah, me. Yeah, just let me bang, bro. Like he's he's like right. We haven't scored. Plan two is just to reduce Cruz. I mean, like honestly, like if I'm playing against Cruz, I think my only chance of winning is removing his whole team. So <laughs> forget positioning. Screw up the <laughs> screw up the notepad. Like throw the. <laughs> Have you see the you seen the clip with uh, Trox Birds, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but he, he tears up the game plan. <laughs> oh man, Trox is amazing. <laughs> and, it, and then just herp up and base and pray. Yeah. Oh, if someone has that clip, it'd be great if you posted it. Yeah, that's an amazing uh, clip. I recorded oh, it, you know. I think I rec I think it was that. That was one. that was one of the best streams ever. Who was the guy? It was like uh, oh, I can't remember. Larkstar. 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 That was it. <laughs> With four rerolls, he could have oh. rerolled that. Maybe he should have. Honestly, that's that's one of those where that's why you've got the fourth reroll. You know, um, you can no, use it on that and that. that oh my god, the ogre's boneheaded again. Yeah, the ogre's yeah. been absolutely pants. Yeah, that ogre bonehead combined with knock, knocking that guy. This, you're getting a lot of trouble next turn. Oh my god, and a skull. Okay, so the oh, real one comes miserable. in there. It's miserable. Yeah. Bruce wishing he was playing chores. Yeah. <laughs> if, if, he, if he had the... Like, you know, if it was possible, I'm sure he would have been, but... Oh, well, I don't know. I don't know. I can't really remember the Blitz Pits well enough. He, he won one with Nurgle, didn't he? He tended to use Chorfs. If, if did he Chorfs win a Blitz were... Pit with Nurgle? Yeah, he did, yeah. It was... He's good at Blood Bowl, isn't he? I mean, it was a pretty good It was a pretty good format for Nurgle. Right? You know, I, I'm not discrediting him, but do you know what I mean? Like, it wasn't that crazy. It was still pretty How crazy. How dare right? you? How dare you insult Bruce for a fight? <laughs> Saying Nurgle were good in that rule set. Oh my god! It, it was a very good rule set for Nurgle, but it, I still wouldn't have taken them, and he still did well to win with them. He's mate. I remember him smashing me with pro elves. <laughs> Four one. Wow. 
He's pretty good with pearls. Yeah. I can't remember what else I've seen him play. I've seen him play Nurgle and Jaws and pearls. Yeah. And obviously Nobs. I played him with like, I think he had Undead or something, I remember. That must have been a while ago. Mmm, long time ago. Oh no, was it was it him who played Andy and beat Andy with Undead? Like in that Undead Mirror? I don't know. I don't know, Jeff. It was funny though, he had, he had Undead and I had like no chance, then I just diced the what? pants off him. <laughs> KO. Yeah, How huge many, guard are gone, and that KO is because he didn't re-roll that hit, and then gave up that hit instead, right? Whereas if he'd re-rolled that that blitz, and maybe got the power, you could have beaten him off, and he wouldn't have taken that KO, maybe. So, Do had, he, he had, he, had he re-rolled that? Had he moved the? Hmm. I wonder. We, I wonder if we're going to see a change of gear here. Yeah, I think he'll definitely score early if he can. I got, he'll just score at any chance he gets. I'm sure. I'm sure the he's thing is though, like the, with the later push, I mean this. I don't think he has a choice. That's what I'm saying, Dimmy. Oh, <laughs> look at that hero fling! I just think he oh hasn't got. God. I just think he hasn't got a choice. He's gonna. He's gonna score if he can. He's, I don't think there's any. I don't think it's Cruz's. It's up to Cruz to like stall or score early or score late or anything. It's I mean, just score the switch if you can. to the left side is pretty good here. Yeah? It's just battle and claw for everything you can. Yeah, it's maybe good, yeah. Yeah, this is maybe good. It's like, battle, scrape and claw for everything you can fucking get. This is a nightmare. He can he can stand the fling up, he can 2D the guard with a guard, he can run that lino through, blitz with the black guy on the floor, hit with the ogre, and then he's got the catcher to move around, and he's got like a whole sideline. Oh, he doesn't even need to do the GFI with that lino, he just runs the catcher around. Yeah. So this is yeah, this is this is sweet as. Oh, he hasn't blitzed. He hasn't. He's not blitzing with yeah, the line. Yeah. So. Oh, the guy on the floor. Yeah, yeah. Well, mm, maybe, maybe he's gonna blitz with the other lineman on the floor. Maybe he's gonna blitz with the ogre. I don't know. No, he's blocked with the ogre. But yeah, that I mean that was the, the yeah, that was what I thought. You know, do these run to here and then blitz. You can be my Stand there. Move the ball up somewhere, you can be mine. but it's uh, it's not it's not great, is it? Whoa! Massive raid! Look at that, Andy Dave, or glorious! Oh, he's gonna blitz with the catcher. So he, yeah, he that's, what I, that's, what I meant. that's what I meant. That's what I meant. I said ogre instead of catcher. You know. Ah, very easy clever. mistake. Easy mistake. Yeah. yeah. The problem is this uh, this lineman could dodge off and blitz him, right? So he wants to. Nice on the uh, oh, look at that! What pro pro play? Does he stay back? No, he's just gonna. Is he gonna expose himself to the blitz? He looks like he is. It's a blocker though, isn't it? It's a four plus. Yeah. I mean, but he's still exposed. Oh, another KO. He's getting pretty diced here. Is is Cruz? Pretty diced. Two cards, <coughs> two KOs. I mean, they are humans, you know, like, obviously I did more than that with my ox, but, uh, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, thank you very much for the raid, Andy Dave, well, welcome Andy Dave viewers, and, uh, yes, this is the Blood Bowl Super League, absolutely glorious, this is Andy's group, um, Hiru versus Cruz, very good, yep. <laughs> so you can't smash the catcher with tackle, that's the thing, I mean, that's the thing though, right, if he does the dodge and makes the sack, like, the ball's on the floor next to the catcher anyway, so it's like... Yeah, true. True. Like, there's no real... Well, I guess the runner is there, but... Well, he can punch him, though, right? He can punch him forward so he can go, like, three, four... Like, it's like four, a GFI, GFI. Like... It's a four um, plus is it a, two plus one, two, one three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's a double GFI, and then a dodge double GFI. So it's four GFIs and a dodge to 2D it and push him back. To there. Well, I would, yeah, but you don't want to assist with the. Oh, he's just stood him. He's just stood him. You don't want to assist with the the recovery, right? Do you? Or you... I mean, you could you could if you wanted two dice, but I would have just one diced him. But you could have yeah. made it two dice. I think like he's. We're gonna see full sideline cage here, aren't we? Yeah, might have to. It's. He hasn't blitzed yet, has he? No. He's gonna see? blitz the ogre, I think. With the yeah, blitz the ogre with the slayer, and then you free up three dwarves. Yeah, that's pretty nice. 
slap the guard in right in the middle and base them all. So they have mm. fun. <laughs> Wednesday evening. Have you got like a specific time yet, Andy, or a preferred no, time? Because I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying to nail down the scheduling for everybody to follow. How many humans left? We got what? Eight? Nine with the ogre? I guess he's still got a couple of players. It just feels like he's got none. Yeah, <laughs> don't a nine really sucks. <laughs> Every time he tells you about 30 minutes. How's your league? Amazing machine. Amazing. You can uh, you can see all the informations about it here. Thanks for the yep. follow. There you go. Here. Um, there's, oh my god, another removal. This is outrageous. Oh. This is absolutely oh, outrageous. Tall. I mean, this would never have happened to nobility. <laughs> never. Um, so this GFI, I mean... Oh, if he fails this, it's yeah, on. Yeah, it would have oh. been on, but it wasn't like on. Donkey Kong. He's moved away, he's moved away! Oh! It, the play is through the middle now, isn't it? It's the only play. That That move over... I think maybe should have been here because now this the only play is through the centre here, right? Like this guy blitzes one, two, three, page? four, five, six, just tag and stuff and potato. Maybe pass to the catcher, like maybe maybe get the catcher on the front, pass it to him because then he, so he can get the catcher that, in range. Hang on, hang on, Jim. Is the geezer with the ball a thrower? Yeah, yes, yeah. yeah. Okay, he's a thrower. Yeah, yeah, that's that's really nice. Really nice. And he's got a full cage, isn't he? Because he's got the little fling there, little fat man. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Oh. GFI. Oh shit! He's done another GFI because he wants to get in the range, I guess. No. Yes. Double GFI you know, is he not is. in range, though, is it? It's because he's not doing a full cage. He's doing a screen. So like. So he that has to hand off to the catcher. One, two, yeah, three, yeah. four, five, six. Yeah, that, he's gonna have to hand off the catcher here. He's gonna have to. This guy's gonna have to like go there or somewhere. He's gonna have to do another yeah. GFI, isn't he? A rush, to a rush. Something. He's he's gonna have to go somewhere. This guy's gonna have to go somewhere. One, two, three, four, five, six. There. Oh yeah, there. That's a really good spot, isn't it? So this guy can go to there. Wonderful square. And then the catcher can run. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh no, it's not so good because then he's blocking the catcher. But he's still blocking the catcher. Three, four, five, six. So he's blocking the catcher even more there. <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, so he's going to GFI with the catcher. Free movement. Free movement yeah. Is he going to double man. GFI and then pass or what? No, he's got the fling, isn't he? He's got the half fling, Jim. He should have stood this guy up ages ago. No, he's going no, to double GFI can, hand. Just... Yeah, double GFI hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that was the play. Oh, what? And then tag the Slayer with the fling. Fling maybe he's just runs forward <laughs> to be a man. This tackler should have stood up 10 years ago, I think. Man, Cruz is pretty good, isn't he? I guess Hero left that one, to be honest. Yeah, I think TBH. he did. Yeah. TBH. Yeah, because they're so slow and unresponsive. I feel like shoring up the middle, even though it's like exposing you down the flank, you then have more to come round and fight him. You know, that's what I was thinking. So I would have been okay with. That's a nice square as well. Oh, he just leaves this guy down. I hate that man. That's two free players. Oh wait. Oh, he's dodging him. Yeah. Oh, he's invisible! Oh, so he re-rolled it, he re-rolled it. Oh, Where he's he putting gone? the guard in front of the catcher. He's put the guard in front of the catcher. Oh, right, yeah. Okay, that's pretty good, actually, isn't it? That's sexy, Jim. Yeah, that's sexy. Yeah, it, means, it. it means if he blitzes the front left of the cage, it means he's got a guard there to help free the catcher so the catcher doesn't have to dodge off tackle. Yep. Oh, um, the rage pause. No, no, it's not a rage pause. It's not a rage pause. It's, uh, I know, he's it's trying to get an alt F4 player. to get rid of the invisible I know. player. Yeah. I know, Jim. <laughs> rage pause chat. Champin <laughs> raging foomin. <laughs> he's, abs he's absolutely livid. That's it. Go for a cigarette. 
Uh, so he made all, he, and then he got that extra dodge. Uh, that was pretty greedy from Cruz, wasn't Mate, it? He's put all the rerolls in. Like to be fair, Jim, he's bleeding out. Like he's he's severed an artery. He's he's <laughs> bleeding out, and he's crawling towards the end zone. Premium mm. medic. <laughs> So it solved it for whoever, whoever quit, but not for us. <laughs> oh, so, fantastic. So we've still got the running man here. Very nice. Hello. Hello, running man. Um, but yes, yeah, so obviously it's stronger to, to dodge out the tackle at last. But um, it means that, you know, it, it was obviously super risky. But uh, he got away with it. Super risky. Good for Chris and he... You know, he's in range, so he can score this turn if hang he has on, to. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We can chain him out of range, can we? Hmm. Yeah. No, no, no in a double GFL. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Five, six, seven, yeah. Only into double GFL. But he's One. doing it, he's doing it. Maybe. I mean, not necessarily. <laughs> but yeah, it's, yeah. it's put him in a double GFI range. Plus, he could like get a screen and stall anyway, right? He's, he's not committed to having to... Uh, well, he's, he's probably the chaining turn. the guard out, right? Chain the guard out and put tackle on the ball, maybe. Maybe yeah. the tackle's better than the... Well, how... Cruz has got no re-rolls. Oh, no, he's got one re-roll. Mm. Um, yeah. Mm, maybe the double... Um, oh yeah, I can see tackle zones. Yeah, I can just click on it and see tackles. So yeah, you can see the tackles. I mean, you've got the you've got the circle, right? Uh, I put the circles on so you can see, you can see where he is. He is in that square. But yeah, I guess One. tackle zones as well. That's such a good square. Oh, the double skulls. Only a push. Is he pushing the guard out or is he pushing the catcher back? Oh no, it was a both down, he's got block. <laughs> oh he's doing you'll do nothing. You'll do this, nothing. This is this is why the guard this we, here we're gonna see why the guard is in such a good square. Also the push was kinda like a frenzy trap, so So he's gonna double tag with block oh no, that's a runner, he hasn't got tackle, has he? Mm -hmm. So he's only gonna get one tackle on the ball and it's next to a guard. Yeah, and there's a guy who can just instantly blitz to free him. Yeah, instant. But then he still has to dodge through. What he's saying is... Okay, he's doing the double GFI. There we go. That makes it hard. Oh, no, it's still... No, it's, no, it's not. It's literally not. It's exactly the same. It's just a yeah. blitz. Oh, he's blitzing oh, this way. Oh, oh, my God. And then he's got the T. Oh, no, he had the T to chain him out. Oh, my God. Well, he could have done it either way, to be honest yeah, with yeah, you. He's, yeah, yeah. You could have done it. Yeah, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Disregard! Errata! Errata! I, I can't believe he didn't do the play that I would do, even though it's the identical play <laughs> from the other square. Hey, this what leaves him. This leaves him up here to to screen potentially as well, doesn't it? So it's probably just better. Oh, <laughs> uh, is there a GFI to score? Uh, yeah, we, there is a GFI to score. Yeah. Mate, how big are his cojones? Because I. have Think I'm scoring. Here. I mean, they're, they're all, all the dodges are pretty good. That's the thing, right? A three plus to move seven down. A three I mean, a three plus, plus, plus buys down. you a turn. A three plus buys you a turn, but it doesn't. It doesn't. Like, if you fail the three plus, you might not score. Yeah. Oh, he's just blocking. So he's just. I, I think he's <laughs> scoring here. I think that block there is saying we're scoring. Unless he's gonna try and cage there. No he's scoring. Yeah. Plus, like you're much more likely to stop the to stop the score if you have uh, a reroll, right? So. Oh, the ogre stays out. Oh, brutal! But he's back up to ten at least, and he's well, one the He's one the half. is gonna die instantly, Jim. Yeah. Okay. Nine and a half. He's back up to nine and a half. <laughs> and uh, but you know he stopped him with a he stopped him with eleven, didn't he? Over seven turns, and now he's just yeah. gonna try and stop him over four turns. So it's definitely doable. I mean, I'd, I'd still rather be Cruz, yep. Yeah, and he's 1 0 up, so yeah. <laughs> What's it? What it's, it's four turns, four turns for the dwarves. Yeah, I'd, I'd bet on a Cruz win rather than a draw here, but obviously, yeah, he's, he's happy Would with you? the draw, isn't he? Would yeah. you? Yeah, I think Cruz will win. I think Cruz will win. I think he'll. Ba I'm backing to stop him here. Couple of stuns here. 
hard. It's helpless, hard to move this fast with the stuns. Depends where the kick is, right? If it's a deep kick, it's yeah, yeah, we need it. to see the kick. It's like, mate, a timeout. Then we're looking at a cruise win, pitch invasion, knocking over three humans. We're probably looking at a draw. Yeah, <laughs> there's all sorts that can happen. Licorice. <laughs> yeah. Very good, Dimra. Well, hey. How to make a smoothie. A licorice movie, that sounds mm. disgusting. Doesn't it, <laughs> doesn't it just? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was my Absolutely instant thought. I was rancid. like, God, can you imagine a licorice movie? <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant coaching. Um, that that a gets Cruz a reroll. Oh my god. I mean, he deserves it, honestly. Brilliant coaching. Absolutely brilliant coaching. And the, oh my god, he's the runner's caught the ball, so. That's an amazing oh. start. I mean, you I know, mean, the both, ball both kick players on. can simultaneously feel tilted <laughs> by that kickoff. Yeah. Don't you love Blood Bowl? Yeah. Don't you love Blood Bowl? Both guys are going. <laughs> Say. Another KO. Look as well, well Cruz has got a a goat cheerleader. He hasn't even got like two assistant coaches. He went he went for one coach and one cheerleader. Oh, that's that's me, Jim. That's me. <laughs> Oh, glorious. Calling him the goat all the time, isn't it? I'm like, go Cruz. Mm. <laughs> Why is there a goat cheerleader? Because he oh, got he, rather than getting like two coaches, or maybe he's like maybe he's got two coaches oh, and a cheerleader here we go. instead of here three we coaches. Go. Two removals. He hasn't he hasn't even blitzed yet. This is, I mean, if Cruz manages to to pull this out of the fire. That was brutal on it, two removals there. Yeah. I bet I wonder if he's regretting his human choices. But then like maybe you kind you kind of expect this. At least it's not overtime format, right? Yes. He loses he loses this game in overtime, right? Yes. So. Yeah. Yeah, that was one of the reasons that I chose like dwarves for the for the season two playoffs was right, like the fact that overtime, you got them overtime yeah. and they're gonna have like you know, seven players left and you know, six players left maybe and you've got eleven. Oh my god. God. Kaz? Yep. <laughs> Neck injury. Oh. Down to seven players. I mean, uh, the, real, the real winners of this one is everyone else in the division, <laughs> isn't it? <It's>, uh, <laughs> Three players removed. A huge draw. Well, I mean, that, it's not a draw yet. It's not a draw yet, Dimmy. Uh, I mean, I think it is. Not I yet. Guess, Don't say I it's guess, over. I guess we... That's a catcher as well, though, isn't it? So he needs two assists to punch that troll. He's well. yeah, going to blitz him, yeah. Plus he's better push direction, right? If he assisted and blocked... If he had, like, double assisted and blocked... He yeah, would have yeah, been yeah. double based if he did. Uh, and you're committing, push, you're so. committing so many. Yeah, Not even so. an armor break. So he, even if even if that was a strength three player, I still like the blitz on him to... Uh, just get him. He's committing to it. He's committing to it. Yeah, this is kind of what he has to do, isn't it? You gotta it's not do terrible. what you gotta do. Yeah, but then you just slap a dwarf in on the tackle guy, let him get surfed, tackle guard in, blitz Ooh, the guard. I'd have left him down. I quite like just leaving him down because first of all, you're not going to make the four plus three plus basically ever. <laughs> oh, what? and then he's got to at least deal with him for the next turn. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, having him there guaranteed is pretty good. I don't know. Yeah, it's 50 50 that he makes the four. Yeah, but then you're going to do the three as well, right? So you're looking at a one in three to get him clear. Or just have him down guaranteed. Maybe even just stand him up to get punched, but like, I don't know. Don't like that. Don't like that. Yeah, this was always the play. I mean, yeah. Yeah. I think this is the uh, draw. Because he's got a little bit of time, hasn't he, with getting that touch back? Ooh, he blocked his path. Stopped him getting too forward. Like, I he mean, could have been too further he's, forward. Nah, he? he's, got, he's got time, mate. Yeah, he's but he's only time. just in range. And he could have been two squares further forward. Like, that matters, man. With dwarves, that matters. <laughs> Believe me, with dwarves, that matters. He could have been two squares further I forward. I tell you what, I tell you what, right? Which is... Uh, oh, no, he's filled it. Bastard. 
I was going to say, you, you could have like 1D the guard and then used your own player to jump over and blitz from behind, but then you're pushing in the wrong direction anyway. Mm -hmm. He's going to have to roll all the dice here, isn't he? Yeah. Hero halfling, dodging, uphill, pushing back one square. <laughs> you can be my wingman anytime. I yeah. can't believe that. <laughs> the, like, not having the ogre here. You can be mine. Yeah, not having anyone. He's out of seven players. <laughs> Look at that, yeah. what a raid. Rick yes, Records, are. what a legend. Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much, Rick. Right. <laughs> you're playing, well, you're playing a bit of fumble, were you? A bit? He's been on it for hours, hasn't he? He's been mm. on it all afternoon. <clears throat> Dedicated. <clears throat> what do you think of gnomes, stuff. Rick? What do you think of gnomes? Surely you're playing gnomes or against Surely. gnomes. Cheers, Chris. I pride myself on my admin work. <laughs> <laughs> Vindictive time out. Yeah, before dodge. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that's the thing. Once you get to, once you get to, like, skill them and they get rodge, really, that mm. is, they become pretty strong then, don't they? But, mm. Yeah, rough without the dodge. Is he, is he looking at the re he's looking at the, the rush. Yeah, he's just gonna go with the catcher <clears throat> and then dodge the guard. Oh, he's, yeah, he's gonna, gonna dodge, dodge the guard. The guard. Reliant on the do guard dodge, absolutely reliant. And uh, this is the problem that I have with with the re in. with dwarves. Doesn't right? need to. With Doesn't humans, need to. this is the problem that I have with humans is that you are reliant on making three pluses. You know, like to win games, you will not. You will never ever yeah. win a game yeah. without making a crucial three plus and while they are 89 percent you're yeah. basically hard capped at, at, at you you will have to do a, th a, cr a critical three plus and like hard dwarves capped. will often have to do critical two pluses and you know elves have to do critical two pluses but like humans are pretty much always unless they dice their opponent they're gonna have to do a critical three plus and it's pretty rubbish isn't it pretty rubbish <laughs> nicest yeah. guy in blood Bowl. His knee just. Who's, who's that? Rick. Who someone someone said that there was another guy that was the nicest guy in Blood Bowl. Yeah, yeah. there's some tabletop fellow, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, yeah. And they said that he was the nicest guy in Blood Bowl. And I was like, wow. Mm -hmm. Throwing shade. Throwing yeah. shade. Throwing shade on our Rick. <laughs> oh look! Oh look! He can't go directly forward. Three, four, five, six. He cannot go directly forward. If he was too further forward, well, he'd still have to go laterally, so it would make any difference. But you know, he might have blitzed this guy or something. Yeah, but the thing is, he's going to fully extend to the right, and then the humans aren't going to be able to cover it. He should have blitzed this guy, shouldn't he? He should have just blitzed this guy and punched through the center. I think. Also, you should have been two squares for a fall, but never mind. <laughs> this is looking a bit tricky now, isn't it? Where's he going to go? Like, stand here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, yeah, he's going to have to stand on this line. And he's going to have to double G if I had to score. <laughs> I wonder how nice he'll be with his head in a freezer. <laughs> oh, dude. Hand off to the other runner. Oh man. Yeah, maybe he's got the other runner down to here. That's not a bad shout. That's not a bad shout. <clears throat> oh, I just can't wait for this halfling uphill free dice cage dive <laughs> into triple powers into Kaz. <laughs> this this is his moment. I, he's going to be out of range, isn't he? <laughs> he's going to be out of range. I wonder if he's going to GFI with Carrier this turn. I guess might as well, because he's going to have to GFI with him next turn anyway. So. I mean, honestly, what a masterclass from seven humans. Mm. Six. Oh, no, it's seven. Six and a half. Six and a half. Don't forget <laughs> the half, Jim. Yeah. Alexa, stop. Oh, Diamond. Hey, it's Diamond. Or Diamond, <coughs> if you prefer. <laughs> Dio, Dio. He's Dio, isn't he? They're all Dios, aren't they? Are they all Dios? Yeah. 
Diomed, always, uh, Diom Lord. Yeah, I've always said Diom Lord, and it's Dionysian, isn't it? No, it's Dionysian. No, it's Dionysian. I I asked him how to say his name, and then he sent me a YouTube video. But he's Dior. It was just someone saying Dionysian, Dionysian, <laughs> Dionysian. <laughs> he's hilarious. Man. Listen, he's one of the funniest blokes I've ever met. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm he's pretty funny, isn't he? Yeah. yeah, it was like when I asked him how to build a Skaven team, and he said, like, all the rats, four <laughs> goblins, and some snotlings. Hey! <laughs> yep. That's correct. So, yeah. Absolute meme lord. That's a bit like whenever anyone asks for, you know, like how to build a knob team. Uh, and I always say, you know, uh, one runner, two blitzers Ooh. and uh, eight long beards. He can, he can, he can hit that dwarf, the blocker in the middle down. And then he's got a T-shape for the chain push to push the runner back one square. Mm-hmm. But I don't know, is that, is that enough squares? No. And he doesn't even need to use the blitz. And he's got these two as handoff targets. I think you uphill him and then 1D power him. Oh my god. No, no, there's <laughs> dice on the ball. ball here. There's dice on the ball here. So you 1D with the tackle guy and then you run the fling in behind the guards. You need to bring the catcher over to tag the blitzer and then you chain. Like You need to 1D power the guards. Hang on, is that a catcher or is that a thrower? Who's and this is the a guy? catcher here. This is a catcher. Oh, that's yeah. sad. Because then you, yeah, you could have like you could have chained the guard out behind, and then you've got the one D if you don't follow. If you power and you don't follow, you got a one D on the ball with a, a, one of the blitzers that you've got to dodge. Yeah. But having said that, you could just dodge the blitzer and put the guard in assist, and then you got the two D for the chain. So yeah, you can get a one D on the ball here if you power. Start with the uphill. Does not He's power. doing it that way, yeah. Yeah. I quite like starting with the uphill, yeah. Because then that gives right. you 2D on the other one and stuff, doesn't it? Potentially. Potentially, Jim. Yeah, potentially. Still a reroll for Cruz, but... uh. Oh, my God. Yeah, because if he gets the pow there, then it's just a 3-plus dodge through for the 1D on the ball. Mm. I mean, it's an uphill, though. Hmm. I mean, maybe, maybe you should have put the guard in. Oh no, it still would have been uphill, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think uphill, and then just go for a four plus dodge, even right. You could do for a three plus four plus. There's quite a few things you can do this turn. Yeah, but now it's it's a dodge, blitz, base. Well, you, I base. mean, he might he might just go for. Oh no, it's a five, isn't it? It's a five. Yeah. Five, four, three. Yeah, I don't fancy that. Oh, he's made his geophys. Is he now hitting him? Oh my god! Well, if you're gonna put him there, you could have just two D the poxy troll set. No, because he wanted to see what happened afterwards, right? To blitz the ball or whatever. Whatever. He's got no rerolls. Yeah, he's in a bit of a pickle now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my god, he could have actually chained the ball back. I think my play was alright. I think I could. I think. I think. Chaining it back, I don't think is good enough to me. Because he can just hand it, it is, to the He's other out of range. He yeah, can just hand it off to another guy. You yeah. made him do a 3 plus. Like, it's not. <laughs> it's not very good, is it? I mean. He's desperate, isn't he? He's got no choice. I mean, he can chain him back now, but it's not doing anything because, again, he's got this 3 plus. Ah, uh, okay. So, yeah, he had he tried to dodge there as well. Yeah, he had he had to do more. I mean, he had to do more with his six players, you know. It's, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm not, I'm not criticising his play. It's <coughs> he needed better dice and stuff, didn't he? I feel Cruz will feel like he's lost this, and Hero will feel like he's won this. I mean, it's a so, draw, though, isn't it? <laughs> I like the way he's insisting on getting the invisible player. I know it's a draw, but like, what I'm saying is, like, it will feel like a loss because you were in such a like good position. Well, yes. I say you were. Like, if he didn't just suffer mass casualties, <laughs> yes. he was probably all right to win this. And then, like, 
Heroes probably feel really like he, he got away with it a bit at the end. A bit, yeah. But there's still dice to roll, right? There's still double GFI or the three plus handoff. Yeah. But it's not. It's not. It's not over. It's not. There's, yeah. There's there's double GFI and and like some blocks. Is the, I mean, one snake in it. One snake and it's. Yeah. It's not over. Don't say it's over. Poor. Bit rowdy. Boy, howdy. It's time to get rowdy. What? <laughs> what? That's a bit round. Yeah, because he he just go through the middle here, doesn't he? Yeah, like he's got the. Yeah, he's got that there. He's got the chain. Oh, he's rolled a one. He's rolled a one. No, he didn't roll another one. And there Boilers, you go. Jim. Spoilers. It's not. It's not where it looked to me. We just watched well, the shared to screen. Like... <laughs> <laughs> ruining my experience. And unfortunately, there's no summary screen in this in this game. So there you go. Oh, Isn't that amazing? No summary screen, but. Uh... <laughs> well, I think it was unbelievable. Cruz didn't manage to win that, having removed eight dwarfs and uh, having twelve players. Man. Yeah, yeah. He, you know, really unlucky <laughs> one. He got he got absolutely bodied. Um, <laughs> If he'd had more players, I reckon he would have got the stop. But, uh, you know, still, you know, good play from Hiru to get through, wasn't it? It's, there's people that wouldn't have got through against Chris there still. Um, so, you know, fair yeah, play to him. Came down to a one in six in the end, didn't it? Mm. He gets to draw five times out of six. So. Yeah. There you go. Like I say, like I say, I think, the winner, I think the winner of that match is everyone else in the division. That's a great result for everyone else in the division. And, uh, yeah, the division yeah. wide open. I mean, these divisions are always very tight and stuff, you know, because I... They're going to be well tight, yeah. Yeah. It's a, I mean, that could be the difference between top and second or second and third for, like, either of those guys, right? So... Yeah. And I, and I, I know what you were saying, like, you know, Chris will view it more as a point lost and Hero as a point won, but... Uh, there yeah, you I think so. I is. think so, yeah. It is what it is. Right, thank you very much, Dimmy. Being glorious having you in the booth. Thank you very much. Cracking game. I really enjoyed the game. Four. Really enjoyed the game. Yeah, well played. well played to both. Thank you very much, everybody. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.